Nerfs are essential for the game's health, as it is impossible to perfectly balance anything from the get-go, and today I gathered the three biggest nerfs in TDS history. The first tower on this list is Ranger, or as some people might remember, Outlaw. The first major blow came during the hardcore testing update, Outlaw was renamed to Ranger, stats were minorly changed, but the biggest part of this update was the removal of hidden detection. That nerf is still giving problems to this day. The second major nerf was on February 16, 2024. That day is marked as the death of stacking, an incredibly off mechanic that allowed to put tens of tower next to each other. This saved lots of cliff space and made commanders more effective. Speaking about commander, the second place goes to it. You might think I'm talking about the May 16, 2024 rework. While it was a major hit, it's not the worst in commander's history. I'm talking about the mega update, as before that update you could stack the call to arms ability. By placing several commanders, you could reach super fast fire rate. This worked well with outlaws, as you could make them fire as fast as many gunners. The next nerf is different from the others, as those two didn't fully kill the tower, they were even needed in some ways. But this one is absolutely brutal, the December 8, 2021 killed Swarmer. I already mentioned this tower in my previous video, but that nerf is so impactful it needs more coverage. While it is classed as a bug, I wouldn't call it that. The Swarmer was a very niche and powerful tower before it, as the only real use it saw were boss waves. When they fixed this bug, many were angry and wanted it to be back.